these flies. Don't ever kill these mosquitoes. Th people think they're big mosquitoes. No, they're not. These are crane flies, and they eat mosquitoes. So leave them alone. They eat the mosquitoes. They eat the bad stuff. So I open up this garage door, and that dirt and over here. Damn groundhog right there looking at me. Look at him. You're going to get mad. Huh? What are you doing? What are you doing? I better leave him alone. He might be mad. <laughs> My son's over here making these boxes. And he staples the pops down. He puts these posts in there. The whole pile of them right there. He's got a couple here. Now you can see him up in the aisle too. We're gonna push him. We push him into the truck like a train of four. And he has this aisle 20, 40, 60 feet of them. You can see they go way back there. Oh, in this aisle uh, 20, 40, 60 feet back there. Let me see if I can get all the. Yeah, he's been making a lot of them. Like a lot of them. And the yeah, truck is going to back in that door there, and we're just running right in. Three wide, or 180 in a uh, truck. Right now, I'm just loading up these toys that we packed. So, all right, that's, that's what he does. And we'll be uh, packing some things over here I got all the parts we're missing a couple parts they're gonna ship them to us and we're gonna take one thing out of each item and put them in them bags and seal them up and throw them in there and then we'll send those out we'll take these and put them out on the table down we'll get one two three four with the bag seal it up throw it in it that's what they do get it Okay. <laughs> Got myself a <clears throat> furnace filter. I have to put it way over there. The furnace is way over there and I got to climb up there and put it in. Ugh, I don't like walking on that thing, man. Do this. I really... This does make me nervous walking up here because I gotta walk like across a two by four, like a tightrope. That thing there, and I have to go all the way over there. And let me turn the light on. There we go. That's a little bit brighter, but it's. I don't like it. Yeah, because this is the office. If I. Well, I'm holding on to the heating duct up here, so I don't like this crap. Whoa. Pretty dirty, huh? Throw that damn thing down there. 
Gosh. Every time I do that, I kind of freak out. I don't like doing that crap, but I did it. Gosh. Wow. Yeah, I should probably change that more often, huh? Uh, you know what? I dropped these about a week ago. And there's a snap ring that goes around this right here. I, I'm looking all over. You know, I can't even remember where I dropped the damn things. But I was like, it must have fell off. I was like, looking for a needle in a haystack or looking for hay in a needle stack. But this morning, look at this. It's right freaking there. How, what are the odds of it right there? I looked all over the damn floor. All right, I, went, I didn't want to show you all the building process. I think that would be a pain in the neck, so. I used two by fours as the posts. I cemented those in there because then I need something beefy like a four by four to put in there. And I got this, this door, it's a thing. It, it, spring, it closes the door. You can see I just got done standing with it today. Um, the more you tighten it up, the tighter it'll close. It'll harder it'll close. And I got my, uh, it's amazing how I, how I got that so accurate. Um, the door, but that's a little latch thing that you could just, you just open it up. And the spring will, you know, it closes and it locks. And, uh, yeah, it took about like, a few hours to, to build it. it. Took probably just as long as to stain it. And another thing, if you screw into the block, I didn't mount, I didn't put concrete down in there because if you remember one of my videos, I have my hose down through there. So I screwed it to the block, but whenever you mount something to a block, mount it to the, put the, drill the holes into the mortar instead of into the block. So there you go. It's not bad. I didn't want to you know, bore you with another fence installation, so I had to I, I put the gaps in there so Aaron can see out through. So there she is. Now she's totally boxed in, I guess you could call that. So and then we're going to extend this flower bed next year. We're going to put the block there and put some some mulch and stuff, and I'll probably put a plastic you know thing up against the 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 board so it doesn't you know so so the, the stuff don't fall through you know what i mean so there you go my little fence thing is uh done and i get a lot of dang crows oh, crows so there you go that's done on to the next project